Hair Shop in South Florida and today we are going to be talking about safe browsing habits and how to clear your history out of Google Chrome. Uh, a lot of people don't know this but when you type in a, um, a search string into Google it creates a history for you and if you sign in uh, to Google Chrome which now Google Chrome allows you to sign in uh, uh, to it and it will completely synchronize your history across all your devices so if you have Google Chrome on your iPhone or your computer at work and you're signed in under this Google account then it becomes uh, uh, any of those machines that could be compromised or if somebody were to use that machine and it's not you could go back and look at your history so uh, you know we just do this here we say um, we're going to look for uh, a BMW uh, car. I'm just going to go ahead and search for BMW car. And then here is our search results. So now, uh, let's just say I look at something that I don't want anybody else to know about. There's lots of that that goes on in, um, you know, when we were looking for things that are private to us. And we want uh, those, that history to be cleansed and we don't want anyone else to look at it. So let's go and actually take a look at what somebody could actually look at when they look at your browsing history. So you can see here we have some things that somebody may or may not want someone else to know that we're looking for. Craigslist massage, sexy girls, you know, whatever it might be that you're looking at. This is the internet. There's everything out there available to you. You can individually um, remove things. If you want to be incognito about it, you can say uh, these are some ones that I don't actually want anyone to look at go ahead and hit you check mark them over here do one at a time if you want remove selected items it says are you sure you want to remove you hit remove very good now I say listen I just want to clear the entire browsing history you click clear browsing history and you can tell it for how long to the beginning of time clear it all out and it takes a second and it cleanses your browsing history. We can go back and look at it by selecting the three lines at the top, going down to history, and now you can see there's no entries found. Now let me just say this. If you think that you're going to be searching for something that you don't want anybody else to know that you're searching for, or you don't want any record left behind, no paper trail, quote unquote, the best option for you is to click this button and hit new incognito window incognito window and you know you're in one when you see this little uh, spy looking guy here it does not record anything you do anything at all everything you're looking at typing searching it completely anonymizes you so that you're anonymous you don't have to worry about cleansing your browsing history or whatever so you feel free to look at anything you'd like and then close the window and as soon as you do so that history uh, th there's nothing recorded no cookies, no nothing. That's safe browsing right there. Very important. And I love Google Chrome. So go ahead and install it, download Google Chrome, give it a shot. And again, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Oh, and please like and please subscribe to my channel. Uh, we're doing a lot of these new tutorials now that are super helpful to most people. So anyhow, thanks again. Have a great day.